The Calvert County, Maryland Commissioner's Reports is a headline news podcast provided in part by the Calvert County Department of Communications and Media Relations. Commissioner's Reports provides highlights from the Calvert County Board of County Commissioners, county government departments, and key government agencies. Commissioner's Reports covers regional happenings affecting Calvert County citizens, news, and upcoming events. Hello, and thank you for tuning in to Commissioner's Reports. I'm your host, Ursel Placide. In this week's Calvert County Board of Commissioners meeting, the BOCC presented proclamations for Constitution Week recognition. September 17, 2021 marks the 234th anniversary of the drafting of the Constitution of the United States of America by the Constitutional Convention. It is fitting and proper to recognize this magnificent document and its patriotic celebrations. The BOCC proclaimed the week of September 17th to be known as Constitution Week. All citizens are urged to reflect on the privilege of being an American with all rights and responsibilities which that privilege holds. Suicide Prevention Awareness Month Suicide is the leading cause of death among all age groups and is the second leading cause of death among individuals ages 10 to 34. Organizations such as Maryland Suicide Prevention and Early Intervention Network, the Governor's Commission on Suicide Prevention, and the Calvert Health Department promote awareness that there is no single cause for suicide and that suicide most often occurs when stressors exceed the coping skills of a mental health condition. The BOCC proclaimed that September 2021 be known as Suicide Awareness Prevention Month in Calvert County. All Calvert citizens are made aware that suicide is a public health issue that everyone has a responsibility to acknowledge and prevent. The Employee of the Month was awarded to Jennifer Treadwell, Systems Analyst 1, Department of Technology Services. The Employee of the Month recognizes superior job performance and individual excellence. The consent adopted the Department of Community Resources FY 2022 Community Partnership Agreement. The Department of Finance and Budget RFP 2021-059 on-call engineering services, water and wastewater projects. The Department of Public Safety tower lease agreements were amended and deferred for a future meeting. In new business, the Department of Public Works budget adjustment BA-011 CP $75,000 was approved. The Department of Public Safety MOU Supplemental EMS Staffing and Calvert County Fire Rescue EMS Departments was approved and authorized the board president to sign on behalf of the county. The Office of the County Administrator Blueprint for Maryland proposed local blueprint implementation board the BOCC directed staff to move forward with appointing a local Kerwin Governance Board and advertisement for citizen appointments along with outreach to BOE, CEA, and CAESS. There was a public hearing with the Department of Finance and Budget American Rescue Plan Act, ARPA, budget adjustment of $8.985 million. Staff recommended a 10-day waiting period for public comment and the board to close the record and return for a decision by the BOCC. The Department of Economic Development State COVID-19 Relief Fund Budget Adjustment 043 $77,031 Staff requested the BOCC to accept public comment and upon the use of the proposed use of funds close the record, approve the Budget Adjustment 043 adopt the resolution and sign the grant modification agreement with the Maryland Department of Commerce. A presentation was given by Calvert Library, One Maryland, One Book, an annual initiative of Maryland Humanities. The goal is to bring together people with a broad range of perspectives in communities across the state using the shared experience of reading the same book. This year is a combination of virtual, outdoor, and optimistically hybrid bringing together. The Book of Delights by Ross Gray is the featured reading. The BOCC held a work session with the Department of Public Works, WEX Sorcell Government Fleet Card Program. There is no meeting for the Board of Calvert County Commissioners next week. The next regularly scheduled meeting is Tuesday, September 28th at 10 a.m. In other Calvert County local news, the BOCC will hold a ribbon cutting ceremony to celebrate the opening of the newly constructed playground at Dunkirk District Park Thursday, September 30th, 2021 at 6.15 p.m. and invites citizens to attend. Families are encouraged to bring children and enjoy the new playground equipment. The park is located at 10750 Southern Maryland Boulevard in Dunkirk. The Calvert County Department of Parks and Recreation invites citizens to participate in the 30th Annual Golf Classic Tournament, Friday, October 1st, 2021. The tournament begins at 9 a.m. at the Chesapeake Hills Golf Course, located at 11352 H.G. Truman Road in Lusby. The entry fee is $80 per person and includes green fees, cart, beverages, lunch, and a chance to win prizes. The tournament format is the Captain's Choice 
or best ball. Tournament officials request that one golfer per team have a six or fewer handicap. Net proceeds from the tournament benefit the Thurman Gray Memorial Scholarship. Calvert County Parks and Recreation operates this program in memory of the late Thurman Gray, a former Calvert County government employee who was active in working with and mentoring Calvert County's youth. The Calvert County Department of Parks and Recreation has joined the ranks of elite parks and recreation agencies across the country by earning accreditation through the Commission for Accreditation of Park and Recreation Agencies and the National Recreation and Park Association. Achieving CAPRA accreditation is proof of Calvert County's commitment to providing world-class parks, facilities, and programs to our residents, said Board of County Commissioners President Earl F. Buddy Hans. This serves as validation that our Department of Parks and Recreation uses best practices in all operations and holds it accountable to meet the public needs. Calvert County is one of only five parks and recreation agencies in Maryland to hold the CAPRA accreditation. The Calvert County Department of Planning and Zoning is seeking information from citizens regarding cemeteries or burial grounds that may be located on private property in Calvert County, especially in rural areas. The planning staff is working to identify, protect, and document these properties for historic preservation purposes. Calvert County renters who have been financially impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic may be eligible to receive up to 15 months of rent or utility assistance through the Emergency Rental Assistance Program. Funds are available for past due and future rent payments. Renters who have been affected directly by the virus or indirectly as a result of financial problems related to the pandemic may apply at calvertcountymd.gov forward slash rent help or call 410-535-1600 extension 2460. The Linda L. Kelly Animal Shelter has 130 animals. The shelter is celebrating Happy Cat Month. Adopt a friendly feline today. Anne Marie Garden Center's Art Fest 21 Arts and Music Festival is September 18th and 19th, 2021. At 10 a.m. to 5 p.m., both days rain or shine in Solomons, Maryland, where the Patuxent River meets the Chesapeake Bay. Join us for a fabulous weekend of visual and performing arts with 175 artist booths, 35 performers on four stages, activities for the kids, great food, and much more. Get your advance tickets at annemariegarden.org. As we head into the weekend weather, tonight, partly cloudy skies with a low of around 69 degrees. Saturday, partly cloudy skies with likely rain at 20% chance. Highs around 80 and lows around 69 with a mostly clear evening. Sunday, mostly sunny skies with highs around 81 and a clear night with lows around 68 degrees. That concludes our broadcast. Commissioner's Reports is a headline news podcast brought to you weekly by the Calvert County Department of Communications and Media Relations. Stay current with other news in Calvert County by following and liking the Calvert County Government Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Calvert County MD and our official website, www.calvertcountymd.gov.